of Chura Chandpur. There are reports of arson at the DC office in the area and several people have been injured. Two people have died, 25 have been injured and this is because of the protest that took place late last night uh, that turned violent. In uh, This is with the security forces clashing with hundreds of people who came out in Manipur's Kuki Zoo tribes dominated Chura Chandpur district to protest against the suspension of a head constable after a selfie of him with the armed miscreants that went viral. We have my colleague uh, Rathip take us to the demand of the protesters and the information on the casualties during the clashes that erupted yesterday. That's right. In fact, uh, this morning there is a total shutdown in Churachanpur town in the entire district which is being called by the Kukizo civil society groups against yesterday's uh, killing of civilians. Remember yesterday uh, evening uh, there was a build-up of mob outside the office of the superintendent of police. Uh, they were demanding that the suspension of a constable posted in Churachanpur uh, needs to be revoked, uh, needs to be withdrawn. Uh, they were demanding uh, after uh, this constable was put under suspension when a photo of his uh, went viral and he was seen in the photo with armed men uh, who claimed themselves to be uh, village volunteers. Remember in Manipur on uh, both uh, sides of the uh, warring communities there are armed uh, volunteers who have been uh, alleged of uh, attacking each other and uh, uh, after this photo went viral the, an inquiry was ordered by the state police headquarters putting the uh, uh, police personnel in suspension and uh, as the uh, crowd grew around the uh, uh, superintendent of police office uh, according to police sources the security forces had to uh, use force, uh, tear gas shells were fired, police says that rubber bullet were fired, How, however Kukizo civil society groups have uh, said that they were live firing, live bullets, uh, bullets were used and soon uh, there were protests uh, uh, outside DT, DC office, the deputy commissioner's office and the uh, SP's office and the deputy commissioner's office was ransacked, in fact uh, uh, several government properties, uh, uh, there were pro arson in several government properties, vehicles as well, in fact uh, uh, then there was uh, this clashes between the sec security forces and uh, uh, you know the uh, protesters in which uh, around 40 odd people that's what we are uh, picking up now from uh, sources uh, that around 40 odd people are injured and in hospital two of them have succumbed to their injuries that's what uh, have been uh, what has been confirmed to us by the authorities in fact uh, massive mobilization of security forces is being done in the area that's what we are picking up from uh, police sources and uh, Internet, mobile internet has been shut for uh, five days uh, in Churachanpur district and the Kuki Zo uh, civil society groups have uh, called for a shutdown. There is a total shutdown in the district. At this moment, the uh, situation remains under control. That's what police sources are telling us. But there is a uh, palpable tension in the area given the fact uh, that this uh, has happened only last night. And remember, Churachanpur is the place from where uh, last year on May 3rd, uh, the spell of ethnic violence in Manipur had started.